singing part of the song. So what I do here is, now you're all familiar actually with that from uh, part one. That's what I play while I'm singing. to the third with the um, slide coming off. Now, what am I doing there? Let me show you. First finger, thumb. Now, you may have noticed I have a closed hand because I have a problem with something called focal hand dystonia but you will probably be able to open your hand and, um, and then you can palm like that. I tend to palm using actually my fingers and my palm, but I'll do a, a, a film about that in the future sometime. Right. <laughs> job actually it uh, slides onto your foot I haven't got it with me right now so you got that bang bang <laughs> Something to bear in mind here, 
which is really important. How do you reckon? Come straight down. Come down to the the uh, just behind. Or well, actually, if you use the slide over the third fret, and if you're not using the slide, then put your finger just behind it. What you had, you had you, how do you reckon? Introduction back in again. Yeah. So let's say that um, when I got there, she was lying on a cool and So it's a great, powerful, fantastic song. Do, 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 do. That's the main thing. stuff I think coming up. I'm going to do a whole series of um, little films talking about the lives of some of these extraordinary singers. I mean we, we've already done Muddy Waters, um, we've touched on Robert Johnson with Walking Blues, although don't forget it was Sunhouse 1930 who actually wrote uh, Walking Blues and uh, and now, of course, Summer House with Death Letter Blues. I'm very excited because I know what's coming next. <laughs> 